Hi there, Becky Belote, and I wanted to share a really cool tip with the border maker today. It's my favorite tool, and we just came out with a new cartridge called Infinity, and you're gonna love it. All right, so first of all, what does it look like? This is what it looks like when you punch it out with the border maker cartridge. Super pretty, right? But there's some other things that you can do with it. For instance, what if you cut it in half? In other words, use our really cool new $10 scissors that have the, the, the really, they're, um, they allow for some really intricate cuts and just go right down the middle. Um, you'll see something really super cool with this once I'm done. All right, so when you're done, this is what one of them looks like. Whoops, <laughs> funny. I'm just gonna go ahead and lay them both down just so that you can see how cool they look. Okay, so totally different look. All right, but what I really wanted to show you is how you can mix and match other cartridges that you probably have with the Infinity, okay? And I, on purpose, just picked ones that you can still get. Um, so I am going to demo how you mix and match these. So take a peek. Let me get set up here, grab a piece of paper. Remember, you just put the paper in, and then you grab your, you know, pop your cartridge in, and then here we go. So the one that I have in is the Infinity, the new one, and I'm going to show you how I mix and match them. So um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to notch it in the middle only. I'm going to pop the cartridge out and throw another one in. In this case, it's the cable chain. All right, and I'm going to show you others, so don't... Don't, um, if you don't have this one, no worries. Actually, this one is still available, so you probably are gonna wanna snatch that one up. All right, so when you're done, this is the look that you get. Super, super pretty, right? All right, but what I also wanted to show you is a cool little technique that you can do with any of our um, border cartridges that have holes like this. I'm gonna take a minute and stick this down real fast. Alrighty, and then I'm going to show you how filling those holes with contrasting color gives it another zing. Um, so let me grab, um, I don't know, how about some of the white here. I'm going to take my adhesive and I'm going to fill in these holes. This is a repositionable tape, so um, I know you're cringing probably if you aren't familiar with repo about the mess that it looks like I just made, but I really didn't. You'll see. And let me see if I can find some appropriate scraps here to fill in the holes. All right, is that groovy cool? I'm gonna, um, I'm not gonna finish it because I have others that I can show you already done so that you don't have to sit here and watch me putting these in. But, is that cool? All right, before I show you all the other ideas, I wanna show you one more uh, really cool thing. It kinda of gives a stained glass look. You wanna cut a mat at two and a half by four and a half. You wanna make sure your Infinity cartridge is in. Again, others will probably work for this. But this is the only one that I've tried. And I'm gonna notch both ends first. So I'm gonna center it in here and just notch both ends. Very simple to do. Then I'm gonna notch the sides. Oh, I didn't push it all the way in. Bad demonstration. Anyways, you'll see it on my finished one. So um, go in the middle now on both sides, and then we're gonna we're gonna pretend like I didn't mess this up and show you what it looks like in the final. Um, so let me hold this so that you can see my face to see. All right. So um, this is what I was was doing. Um, and then you can put mat a piece of color behind it. And if you do it twice, and then do one where you cut one of them off and just use the middle part, you almost can do a full 12 by 12 border. I could even see you putting the scraps back in the holes to get kind of a stained glass look. So anyways, mess around with it. I haven't done anything um, in my scrapbooks with it yet, but I'm gonna, all right? So anyways, I wanted to show you some other combinations. This one is Infinity with Tweed. This one is Crystal Chain with Infinity. Um, down here we have um, the one cut in half like I showed you earlier with um, Flower Child, which is a border um, punch. Over here I have Cable Chain again with Infinity. I just did, 
different spots. Uh, this is infinity with just, you know, running um, strips across the top. I love that look, actually. Um, this is simple leaf with infinity. This is that super cute fish border maker cartridge. Um, I think it's upside down with infinity. Um, this one is ruffle trim. Um, if you didn't get one, don't worry. They're coming back probably um, early November. Um, so hold out for it. It's a really good one. It actually does it in curved like this. Um, this is medallion with infinity. And this is infinity with, again, those little strips running across the top and on the bottom. So I hope you love these ideas. I hope you'll go try them. And um, thanks for watching. Bye.